What's up folks? Today is the perfect day to introduce the South German dish called Käsespätzle. This is for you if you are a mac and cheese lover. So basically everyone. We start with a dough by mixing 3 cups of all purpose flour with 1 tablespoon of vegetable oil, 2 tablespoons of salt, 1 quarter cup of water and 4 eggs. Get a spoon or a whisk and mix everything well. After a while, add another 1 half cup of water and mix until you get a very smooth gooey batter. Put the bowl to the side to rest. The next step is building a tool to make the noodles. Get a large juice or milk box and poke some holes with a scissor on the bottom. But promise me that you won't get hurt. Make the holes bigger by using a pen. It should look like this. I know it doesn't look beautiful, but it will do the job. Now cut the top off for our opening. That's where we will pour in our previously made batter. Fold the sides together. The idea is to squeeze it like a toothpaste tube to press a batter out of the holes. That should work. Prepare a large pot with boiling water. I already filled our DIY tube with most of our batter. Use both hands and roll the top together to squeeze out half of the batter into the pot. Make a quick stir and put the lid on the pot and cook the noodles for about 4 minutes. Just a small consistency check. Mmm, perfect. Get the noodles out and put them in a second pot with ice cold water to prevent further cooking. Now is the time to make our second batch. While the second batch is still cooking, take out the first batch of the ice bath and put them in a third bowl or pot. You can get new ice cold water, but it should be just fine if you put lots of ice cubes in the second pot. Repeat the steps from the first batch. Now I got some extra dough left, so I thought I'd show you how you can make these noodles without the press. Get a cutting board, place a batter close to the edge and scrape off tiny bits of it and let them fall into the water. That's a classic way. We are finally done with our noodles. By the way, in German these type of noodles are called Spätzle or Spatzen. And they kinda look like Cheetos, right? Get an oven proof pot with a lid. Cover the bottom and sides with butter. Spread the first half of your noodles in the pot. Next comes a large amount of Emmentaler cheese. I'll let you decide how much cheese you want, because there's no such thing as too much cheese, right? Spread the second half of the noodles evenly and cover it with more cheese. Garnish the top with fried onions. For a better taste, I suggest you caramelize some sugar while frying the onions in a pan. Put the lid on and place the pot in the oven at 400 degrees Fahrenheit and bake it between 20 and 35 minutes. It depends on how big your pot is. Now serve it in the pot and enjoy the following scenes. If you're not a cheese fan, you can also serve Spätzle as a side dish with vegetables and meat on a platter. Another idea is to fry Spätzle before serving it with a schnitzel. Or leave them just plain and serve it with roast beef. 
but I like my spätzle with a load of cheese and some pepper and salt on top. I hope you enjoyed this video. Leave a comment if you have special wishes for the next one. See you next time.